Good day and welcome back to another DB Legends video. In this video we're going to be taking a look at, well, the latest raid to come to DB Legends. Now this is the third raid of the non-stop raids for the Legends Festival 2023. And with this raid comes a new raid medal and of course the third raid honor. Now at this point if you have not done any of the first two raid honors you are going to be unable to get the multi z power however however they sometimes change one of the raids to give out two raid honors they might do that don't know uh, but basically at this point you should be on your way to your third raid honor obviously to get the raid honor you have to do nine limited time attempts what that means is the raid is up six days you have to do three limited attempts on three different days or you can do two on every day you can whatever you want but you gotta get nine limited attempts in total and remember you can only do three a day so that means in theory you have 18 attempts to get nine limited time attempts it's not that hard now in terms of the actual raid itself of course the list of battle bonus characters has changed most of them should be the same especially the summonable ones remember that you want to have a battle bonus character as your attacker but your supporters, you want to be full of battle of bonus characters because you want to have extra medals, extra drop rates, etc, etc. So make sure that you do that. It's super important that you basically have a full roster of bonus characters because this is what's going to largely determine how many rewards you get. So it's very, very, very imperative that you basically make sure that you have a whole bunch of bonus characters because this is what's going to determine you getting a whole bunch of extra rewards and basically making your life a lot easier. Now, of course, outside of that, actually the medals you get from the raid itself are worth quite a bit in terms of rewards. So it's not just the raid honor that we're looking at, but the actual raid itself drops 700 chrono crystals, which you can get by exchanging in your raid medals. You also do have a brief window where you can still exchange the raid medals from the previous raid. However, this does go away after a day or two so please make sure you exchange those in now. And that's that. That's basically everything you need to know. Honestly speaking, it's nothing too crazy. It's pretty straightforward and super duper simple. Now if you need help with the actual raid itself, we'll discuss that. But otherwise, you should be pretty good to go. So now, in terms of raids, basically they run the same as hyperdimensional cop. So if you do a hyperdimensional cop, you should know how to do a raid. It's nothing too crazy, it's very straightforward. All you have to do is break the boss's shield, which you can do by attacking him with your ally. Then when the boss's shield is down, you just need to hit him with a rising rush. It's literally that simple. You and your opponent need to do the rising rush at the same time. So wait until you can see that your or opponent, your ally. So wait until your ally has their rising rush as well. You can see their dragon balls on the left hand side. And then when you both hit your rising rush just make sure that you get the pendulum in the correct zone and you should be good to go it's really honestly quite simple and straightforward other than that there are a couple things like you can intercept attacks for your ally which you can do if they start to get low on health and you can also of course clash with the boss if you and the boss do a strike card at the same time your clash and then your ally can join in to do some additional damage there are some small things you can do, like using special attacks to increase the amount of damage you do after the shield is down. But generally speaking, if you have a battle bonus character, and your ally has a battle bonus character, then hitting a rising rush at the same time usually results in you being victorious. It's really that simple. But yeah, that's basically it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, and if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments down below. It's always appreciated to you know be able to help you guys out and just yeah basically i will assist <laughs> is as much as i can kind of promise but that's it for me hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did leave a like and i will see you guys in the next one so until then as always thank you so much for watching take care stay safe and i'll see you guys in the next one bye